With your question, how do you create master templates in Word? I'm not sure exactly what you mean. You can create templates and you can use like a master template. Um, for let's say, for example, if you're designing a template for a client with all their brand, brand material, their, uh, all their styles and things like that. And then you would base other templates, like a letter document, like an invoice, like a very, like a report off of that mask off of that main template so it's not a master template as such and it's not something that you actually create in word it's just a template which you're using as a master if that makes sense however in word there is a master document functionality and just let me let me show you this now it's not something that we use that that much to be honest with you um, and what you need to do is, you, first of all, your document needs to be set up correctly. Now, this is a book I actually, this is one of my books, sorry, my dogs are barking. This is one of the books that I created um, and published on Amazon. And if you look in the navigation pane here, if I reduce it to heading level ones, you see I've got the front matter here, then we have introduction through to conclusion. Now, when you want to use the master sub document functionality, Word will break your doc, your sub documents it, by your heading one. So each heading one, i.e. each chapter of your document will become a separate file. Okay. So in this case, it's going to give me sort of six or so files. But the thing is, I can't just run it from, from here because if I try, if I select all, then I click on view, then I click on outline. Here you can see master document. If I click on show document, now I get the option to create the sub documents and it'll fail because there are it's not recognizing the heading levels because it's not this is a book it's not been designed to be split down like that however if I come back to my main body of my document put my cursor at the front of a heading one as you can see on the the toolbar here and I select to the end of the document now I come back into my master document and create now you can see what Word's done. Word has put this this outline around the main sections of, of my document. If I come up onto the ribbon and I select all levels, just level one, i.e. the heading ones, now you can see what it's done. It's created these sub-documents, okay? Now if I wanted to save this, this would save each of these as an individual file, and that would then allow your different authors to work on each document and that's how we would create the master and sub documents okay you can see the functionality here um, when we do show document collapse sub documents we can unlink we can split we can lock document it's um, I wouldn't say that I've used this functionality of late probably not within the last 15 years to be honest with it um, it used to be very unreliable before word went to XML um, based documents in 2007 or with the release of 2007 but that's how you would do it okay and then you'd work on the documents you'd bring them all together and then you would do the, the create you know you'd do the collapse sub documents you'd bring all the documents together with the run the table of content or update the table of contents I should say and then compile the document like that again the functionality is there it's not brilliant um, and you do have to be very, very careful with it, but that's how it works. Okay?